Hi, everyone. Alexa and I welcome you to our podcast. And uh, today, we're going to talk about a really great method of stress relief and recovery. It's called Rolfing after Ida Rolf. But let's just review what we did yesterday to give it a little more context. Yesterday, we said one of the greatest tools for stress relief and recovery is massage. We call that the Rolls Royce of stress relief. Why is it so good? Well, it's so good because it works all 640 muscles of the body on the outside. And a lot of people have stress and tension. And it was based on the Nobel Prize by one of the great Huxleys who worked out how muscles work, the sliding filament theory. Muscles contract, the two proteins act in myosin, and then they relax. So over a lifetime of stress, injury, muscle contraction, and then don't forget about gravity is we all feel uh, tight sometime. And Alexia and I get massage every day because we realize it's so important. But let's say you have a magic wand and can remove all 640 muscles on the outside. I call that the red stuff, okay, for obvious reasons. What is left? Well, there's a lot of stuff left. There's an incredible architecture left, just like the Eiffel Tower. And the architecture is really fantastic. And that I call the white stuff. And the chemists call it collagen. And the histologists call it connective tissue. And the gross anatomists, they call it fascia. If that fascia is organized in a tight cable, then we call it tendon, muscle into bone. If that fascia is organized into a tight band, which holds the bones together, then we call it ligaments. So it's all over the body. And I'll probably just use either the term fascia or connective tissue just for simplicity. And even all of your internal organs are held up in the abdomen by a special type of connective tissue called mesentery or else everything would just fall to the bottom to the pelvic basin. Okay, so Ida Rolf, what is her genius? Her genius was to develop a whole system of body work from her own injury. She was a top-notch chemist around 1929 at the Rockefeller Institute in New York City, one of the most prestigious institutes in the world. And she got kicked by a horse. She went to the orthopedic surgeons. <laughs> they couldn't do too much. So what she did, she took her family in a car and she went all around the country studying all different modalities of healing. And what she came up with, she was so smart, she came up with a system which bears her name, it's eponymous, is Rolfing, Ida Rolf. So it's kind of complicated, but let me just kind of reduce it to the simplicity and the heart of it. She uses a metaphor that all the connective tissue, or if you wanna say fascia, is totally connected around the body like one seamless sweater. Sublime metaphor, holistic. Meaning if I have an injury here and the connective tissue tightens, it will be reflected all over the body. Wow, what a concept. So is even in medicine is there's a movement to accept the totality 
of the connective tissue as a newly discovered organ. Just like Alexia and I mentioned way back in one of our earlier podcasts, how the microbiome is a newly discovered organ. Imagine that when I was in medical school over 50 years ago, is uh, the connective tissue was not a newly discovered organ, neither was the microbiome. These are exciting new discoveries. And uh, I even have a hard time keeping up with the breakthroughs that are coming so fast. So the big takeaway for today is the incredible architecture of the body. Think of what mother nature gave us. What incredible architecture. And there's two main divisions for understanding. There's the outside 640 voluntary muscles. And we call that the red division. Okay, because muscles are red. And is the totality of the connective tissue. And that is white. And we call that fascia, connective tissue, tendon, and mesentery. So the massage therapists, they work on the red stuff. And that is one of the greatest tools in stress relief. Remember yesterday, the effleurage, the sweetest massage, guaranteed stress relief. The genius of uh, Ida Rolf was to work on the white connective tissue, the fascia which wraps around the muscles, like if you buy uh, uh, some uh, hamburger, let's say uh, uh, at a store and there's a saran wrapping, that would be the fascia, which tightens up over the years, especially in seniors with gravity, injury, and just simple contraction. So it's so important to loosen that up and that would be incredible stress relief. And Alexia mentioned uh, one more pointer uh, for everyone out there is that is the word protein comes from the Greek meaning of first importance. And indeed it is because it's your whole body, not only your whole body, but every single chemical reaction needs an enzyme. And guess what? All enzymes are protein. So the bottom line is that your structure is protein and your chemistry is based on protein of first importance. And Alexia mentioned that the number one protein, which is given a rating of 100, the gold standard, the benchmark, is actually the protein which is found in the white of egg called albumin. And that protein is virtually identical to your own body protein. So if you want to really build up those two compartments, the red compartment, the 640 muscles, and the white compartment, which is chemically collagen, okay, is please take the very, very best protein with all 20 amino acids and a beautiful spectrum. So once again, Alexi and I thank you so much for having us and we will look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.